you want to ride your mountain bike fast, you need to be prepared to move your body and your bike around a lot. It makes a big difference to the speed you carry through corners, down descents, not to mention if you start getting airborne. But fortunately, it's not complicated. Here are the basics explained so that you can go and hit the trails fast. Firstly, let's split it into two positions, seated and standing. Generally, seated is the more efficient way to ride, but you will need to get out of the saddle for max power and short, sharp effort. However, this is mountain biking, so seated efficient pedaling is not always what you're after. When the going gets technical, you need to adopt the attack position. What you're looking for here is a neutral position on the bike. So how do you do this? Stand tall on the bike with your legs and arms slightly bent so you are ready to absorb any hit that the trail may throw at you. This will be your go-to position when you are cruising down a mellow trail. You should adopt this position when the trail is too rough to sit down or at higher speeds when you need to be able to make adjustments to the bike underneath you in order to stay in control. A critical skill and a sign of a competent mountain bike rider. When you are able to look past your front wheel down the trail, this means you are better prepared for approaching obstacles. Even the best riders in the world will constantly have to remind themselves to do this. Leaning the bike over is a great skill to practice. The secret here is to lean the bike underneath you and drive your weight centrally through the bike from your outside pedal. This forces the edges of your tyres into the ground, giving you maximum grip. You would use this skill in flat corners where there is no rut or berm. Your starting position is the attack position, the neutral position you adopt for general trail riding, such as single track. From here, you lower your heels on the pedals and drive your hips back as far as you can. Adopt this position when riding steep descents. This will help control your speed and stop your weight being pushed forward and causing the dreaded over the bars. I often see a lot of people that struggle to get their weight back, so practice on flat ground and see if you can get your bottom to touch the rear tyre. The steeper the trail you are riding, the more important it is to get your weight back. No matter which position you are in, there are a few key fundamentals that you need to remember. One of the main ones for me is to always try and stay relaxed. Absorb the majority of the bumps through your legs and guide the bike using just your arms. There are plenty of times where you need to stay seated to pedal through rough or technical terrain. And in these instances, your arms need to stay relaxed and you need to be prepared to get your ass out of the saddle very slightly to ease yourself over bumps. Now I find it helps to use a slightly bigger gear than I would normally so I can lean on it just to lift myself out of the saddle. It needs to only be fractional, but it does really help. So that's it, the basics of body position on your bike. It's really about moving your weight around and using your weight properly on the bike. If you want a more in-depth look at skills, please check out the videos here and here. And please don't forget to subscribe to us at GMBN.